Hi, this is T with T Quilts, and today we're working with a 9 inch finished Dolly Madison star. So it would be 9 and 1 half inches unfinished. So for cutting, you're going to need a white background for each 3 and 1 half inch squares, 5 each 1 and a half inch squares, and then 1 each 4 and 1 half inch square. From a red fabric, you're going to need one four and one half inch square. And then from a blue fabric, you're going to need two four and one half inch squares and four one and a half inch squares. The first step is to make a nine patch with your one and a half inch squares. So you're going to align them as shown in the video and sew them into a block unit. Here is my nine patch unit. It should finish after sewing three and one half inches unfinished. So I'm going to move that to the side. The next step is to take our four and a half inch squares from the red and the white and draw a line diagonally through the center. Then you're going to match those up with your four and one half inch blue squares, right sides together, and you're going to sew on both sides of the sewn line. So I will do that and come back with my next step. I'm back with my sewn seams. I've sewn down each side of the drawn line one quarter of an inch. And then I've already made the first cut to my white background print here to show you what I want you to do. I know we normally will cut down the center line, but first I want you to cut in the non-directional line. So I want you to cut the opposite corner to corner from where you have drawn your line first. And then when you do that, you can pull it apart and then cut this way. If you cut the other line first, you may have a difficult time finding the center to cut straight up. Or you would have to use the 45 degree markings on your ruler if you forget. So I'll go ahead and cut these units apart and I'll be right back. All of my units have been cut apart. I pressed all of my seams toward the dark blue print. And now I want to sew these units together. I have mixed and matched my pieces and I now have my hourglass blocks so I'm just going to sew these blocks on the diagonal. Here are my four units sewn and I came back because I have squared up my units to three and one half inch and I just want you to see that this one has not been squared up and when I place this unit on top of this one I'm going to rotate it so you can see the difference in color and how much will need to be trimmed. So it's very important that you square these blocks up to three and one half inches. 
So I'm going to go ahead and lay out my block. I will trim the other block up off camera, but I want to show you what this block will look like. Keep in mind where the white prints are. Those you want on the outside of the block. Then you have your nine patch in the center and then your four remaining white squares will go in the corners. So that is how you will sew the Dolly Madison star together and I will just add a photo at the end of this video of the completed block. I'll go ahead and say thank you for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye-bye.